Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm back with some Pokemon Nuzlocke. We finally beat the first gym leader, and so now we're gonna- I'm gonna have to go up Bell, Bellsprout Tower, but before we do that, I'm gonna actually catch a new Pokemon. Because we have not done that yet. But if you like me doing my Nuzlocke, and you end up liking this video, please leave a like. It helps me out, and I like seeing the likes. So, let's see. We have a list of people, but there's also specific Pokemon that if I run into them, they're named after good buddies of mine. Good buddies of mine, excuse me. So let's see. Let's see if we can catch one. Oh, shit! Hell yeah! It's a Wooper. Okay, Wooper. Okay, the last time I tried to catch a Wooper, it almost died. You know Water Gun? Oh, he's awesome. He's so cool. This is also unfortunate because if Mouse dies, no one can catch you, Wooper. All right. Come on, Pokeball. Come on, Pokeball. One, two, three. Cut. Gotcha, Wooper was caught. Perfect. Wooper's data was neatly added to the Pokedex. Wooper, the water fish Pokemon, when it walks around in the ground, it coats its body with a slimy poisonous film. Then how come he's not a poison type? Yes, we will give a nickname to Wooper. Now let's see, who gets the lucky distinctors of being the Wooper? Oh, you know what? It'll be Solrock, because he's the only other person. So, if you don't follow me on Twitter, which you should, um, Solrock is... Um, when I started, he was basically my opposite because I only have Wooper picks on um, Twitter and he has Oxalotls, which are the actual, what Wooper's based off of. So he was always like the live action version of me. Um, so he will be the Wooper for us. Let's look at him. All right. Yeah. Now, obviously I would be the Wooper, but I'm the trainer. So that's not gonna work out. All right. I also realized that Sor Sorok is the only person with his name spelled correctly. Everyone else has theirs in all caps. But it's fine. It's there for emphasis. Alright, man. Man, with a Wooper. Unfortunately, I don't know if Wooper is going to be very... No, he is going to be very helpful for us. But I don't know how... Um... I don't know how many... It's going to take a while. Because, like, the next gym is weird. It's bug type, and then it's normal type, and then it's... Um... What comes after that? It's ghost type, there you go. So there's no like, anything immediate that Wooper can actually hurt for a while. But it should be fine, let's see. Let's look at your stats real quick. You know, water gun, tail gun. Oh, and you're female, that's perfect. I say kind of creepily. All right, it's time to train up Nooks. And let's see if we run into another buddy in the Bellsprout Tower. Now, here's another thing I have to remember is that before I get to the very tippity top, that there is a rival battle at the top. <laughs> so I have to watch out for that. Hello. Doom, 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 doom. Hello, old man. Fight me. However hard we battle, the tower will stand strong. Ominous. I think, it, so is the, like, the basic premise of this tower is that it's a bunch of people worshipping Bellsprout? Because look at that thing, and you're telling me that you worship this? Look at it, man. It doesn't even look alive. Wow, Nux. Nux hasn't been featured in an episode, and all of a sudden he comes out swinging. Alright. Good job, Nux. You were gone for a bit? But you're perfectly fine now. That's right, I turned off set. <laughs> so, that's gonna be interesting. Let me see. I want you to at least learn Ember and then I'll switch you out, I think. Let me see. No. Hmm. So, here's the thing that's really bad is that my rival's um, Pokemon is a um, water type. <laughs> so, none of my Pokemon actually can stand up against them at all, like in any capacity. Which means that's bad. That's bad on a lot of for a lot of reasons. 
Uh, it's bad because it means no one can actually legitimately hurt him, and he'll know Water Gun by the next time we see him, which is up this up this tower. So I don't know what to do. We have to train up Mouse, and Mouse has to be the thing. So I need to actually start training Mouse now. You are too weak. You're a weak old man. Get out of my face, you weak ass man. Okay, because again, um, Whooper is water ground, so that's not gonna help at all. But just to be sure, are you full water? Yeah, water ground. Water ground. Okay, let's roll. And we got a paralyzed heal, not bad. Again, we need to start training up. Good old mouse. Hello, old man. We stand this ground. <laughs> oh, no, that's different. I don't think you can stand this place. Sage Chow. Tasty. Love another level three bell sprout? Okay. I'm starting to think that this was the place that you were supposed to go to before the gym, but I always do this place after the gym, because it never felt like there was a reason to go up this tower. At least to me. Tackle. Tackleberry. Got him. Yes. Good job, Mouse. You need to be big and strong if you're gonna... There we go. Hell yeah. Quick attack. He needs to be big and strong if he's gonna be helping us take down a Totodile. Because Totodile ain't, ain't ain't no shit from no man. Yes. Good job, Mouse. Good job. And hit him with the quick attack again. Nice. Nice, nice. Bellsprout. Okay. So here's the thing, I didn't actually think that I would get past the first gym leader, because I thought that I would, sh the second that I remembered that he had mud slip, I thought it was going to die. <laughs> so now I don't know what to do. Um, especially with so many people, like, expecting to be named after a Pokemon. It's a lot of pressure, man. But we'll get it done. I'm going to go down and heal Mouse. Because needs healing. Mouse needs healing badly. Excuse me, excuse me. Going through, going through. Man, I wish I could run. But I'm not playing the DS version. Maybe I'll switch to the DS version once I lose. <laughs> Just kidding, I'm not gonna lose. We're going all the way to Cam, baby. Of course, Cam was the hero of our Pokemon Yellow, so I assume that's him waiting at the end of um, Mount Silver. Oh man, we have five Pokemon. Well, technically less, because we have an egg. Later, dude. Later, nurse dude. Let me see, is there anything I need from here? I know there's charcoal, I think, but I don't know if... No, there's not charcoal. You know what, I'll check after this. You never know. I know someone wants to trade you, I think, an onyx for something. But I can't for the life of me remember what. Going through. Excuse me. I was about to say, are we already at the end? No, we're not, I think. Boom. X defend. I might actually use some of these X defend stuff because, like, I might need it for, like, when I need an actual quit. Tell me why, Sway. Say word, Sway. You said word. Sage Edmund. <laughs> That's a weird name, as considering everyone's up to this point was named Chow and something else. Sage Edmund feels like he was, a. Uh, grew up in Toronto or something. And then he came over here and he's like, I've changed my ways. Quick attack. God, Mouse is just so quick. I like how I said like, this is Nux's training ground and then I remembered Nux is actually super weak as hell to everything. Specifically that the, the rival has. It's really just that, is that the fact that the rival has um, water gun and we don't. It's, in, it's insanely, crazy how much our team is weak to water. Our team with a water type in it is weak to water. Think about that for a second. All right, good job, Mouse. Mouse cleaning house? Technically Bellsprout house, but. All right, later. Get better, nerd. Okay, he's all the way at the top here. 
I should have enough potions and I should be able to take them on. I think I got this. Now, hopefully none of you dumb fucks has a ghastly, because if you did, I might actually be angry. Because that would completely throw off what we're doing. Yeah, Edmund is like the odd man out, because this guy's name is Jin. Oh, level six. Holy crap, that's... So here's the thing, I think Mouse is very strong, and I love Mouse. The problem with Mouse is that the second Pokemon start to be closer to his level, the more likely that uh, Mouse dies because he's a Ratatata, and Ratatatas are weak. I say as he beats the crap out of that Bellsprout super easily. Take that, Jin. That's right, you were beaten by a child. But -da -da. Oh, so this isn't where you get cut, it's where you get Flash. Duh, I guess that's kind of, I guess that kind of goes without saying. Alright. Please do the same tactic as that last guy and try and use, um... Come on. Not bad, not bad. It is my head that is too bright. Alright, I'm gonna save because I like to save. And when I don't save, I feel antsy. Alright. I'm sorry for everyone for the clicking of- I just can't stop myself. <laughs> I just like to do it too much. I trust my Pokemon a lot. I trust Mouse to win the day. Sage Troy. Now here's the thing. It's I think my rival has a Pidgey. But I don't know if I want to risk the idea of switching into Mouse. Because if I switch into Mouse, I'm dead. Okay. This is uh this is what I was saying about being scared for mouse. Please don't crit. Oh thank god. I forgot you had a berry. Okay. Okay, quick attack. Jesus Christ. That scared me. I was afraid. I was legit afraid. Oh, hoot hoot. Okay. You're gonna level up like crazy here. You're gonna be, I think, the highest- No, because Geodude is still the highest level Pokemon. Oh, now you can see me? That's great. Because that's- Now you can see me kill you. Yep. Dead. Oh, Mouse. I love you, Mouse. I hope nothing bad happens to you, Mouse. Troy was defeated. Your trust is strong, damn right. Alright. Pretty sure he's up there. I'm gonna save even though I know for a fact that's not gonna do anything. <sighs> okay. If I can end this encounter without losing a Pokemon, I think that is ideal. I'm gonna remove this from you. I'm gonna give it to Mouse. Perfect. Now, in a bold move, I am also going to heal Mouse. Even though it's only six. I just don't want to go back to the Pokemon Center. And I think I'm also gonna throw X Defend on him the second the fight starts. Okay. What? There he is. Elder, you were indeed skilled as a trainer. Here's your HM, but let me say this. You should treat your Pokemon better. The way you battle is far too harsh. Pokemon are not tools of war. Humph. We claims to be the legend, but he's weak. It stands to reason. I never lose to fools who babble about being nice to Pokemon. He should buy my extremely expensive gifts. That's right, I forgot your name is Legends. Oh, I don't have to fight Legends. Oh, goddammit. <laughs> Oh, I had to fight you. Okay. I'm a dum dum because now I feel foolish. I trained Mouse for nothing for a fight that he's actually no, it's fine because Mouse is gonna have to be up and running for a fight later. How strong are these bell sprouts? Jesus. Okay. So I'm gonna go to the quick attack thing. And I think I'm gonna go with my original strategy, which is just letting Mouse win. I really thought I was gonna have a rival battle, so this is kind of a letdown, because now I'm not having a rival battle. 
And Mouse is gonna easily clean sweep this man. Yep, you only got Bell Sprouts. I can take down a Bell Sprout. Growth. Gross. Okay. Not bad, crit. Mm, and a hoot hoot. I mean, for safety's sake, uh, no. This is the mouse video. This is mouse's time to shine. Mouse is gonna quick attack and mouse is gonna win. We came here with the plan of mouse is gonna win, and damn it, mouse is gonna win with no help. Get done, mouse. Please don't get done. Don't please don't die from this mouse. Okay. Whew. Man, Mouse, I don't know what's gonna happen to you later on. <laughs> Every battle with you is another one where I'm wondering, is this where you die? Sage Lee was the dead. He's defeated. All right. You and your Pokemon should have no problem using this move. Take this flash. And then he flashes me. Do you like that? No, I don't. No one likes flash, old man. It's a powerful painting of Bellsprout. Alright, so... Pretty sure they want me to use Escape Rope, but... That's not happening. I'm just gonna go the hell the long way. Uh, it saves me an Escape Rope, and I get to have a victory lap as I go around all these old men going, That's right, you got beaten down by a Ratatata. Except for you, the guy in the beginning who got beaten down by my Nux. Cyndaquil brother. Alright, let's do it. Man, crazy episode for today. We've learned a lot. Mouse got stronger. Let's um take this off of Mouse now. Take and give. I think I'll start training um Solrock Solrak when I enter um the cave because then there'll be plenty of Geodudes for him to kill. Uh, until then, you know, I'll just hold on to him for now. I also need to find a map so I know exactly where the roots start. I don't know why I don't have a map right now. I just want you get one by now. Actually, let me double check the nav just in case I, I actually have a map this entire time and I don't know it. But I could have swore I had a map. Um, but I've never used it. Pokey gear. No, what? That's crazy. So pack. Yeah, I guess I just don't have a map for now. <laughs> Alright, I'll figure out how to get a map later. Until then, everyone, I hope you liked it. And if you did, leave a like. And I'll see you guys for the next installment of whatever video you see from me. Goodbye.